Thank you very much. <laughs> Beauty to me is diversity. It's always something people aspire to be. If you're confident, you're beautiful. Thank you. I appreciate that. <laughs> it doesn't matter what makeup you have on, how you look, uh, the clothes you wear, your body size, but it's just as long as you love you, you're beautiful if you're skinny or if you're toned or if you're a little confident. Beautiful to me. You can be beautiful, but you can be tons of other things, and it shouldn't be the main thing that you know you should be. <laughs> I'm like, what if everyone just embraced who they are? You have to have long hair. <laughs> <laughs> Being light skinned, they have something beautiful or unique about them. They thought dark was not beautiful. I like buying makeup. I don't use it. I think I like the packaging, the commercial, the experience of going into a makeup store and getting it. I love makeup. I think on bad days, if you really want to boost up the, the confidence, you know, just lather on the makeup. It's great. You're kind of creative using different lipstick shades and, you know, really doing your eyeliner a certain way is, uh, is great. And how you choose to show yourself is how you identify yourself. I don't know if that makes sense, but I don't wear foundation. I don't wear primer. Today I have makeup on. That's why I feel confident. That's why I can actually talk in front of camera, but if I didn't have makeup on, I would be like, don't look at me, you know? That if I put on some chemicals on my lips, that all of a sudden that I can be um, someone else. In the morning when I'm putting on my makeup, I can decide who I am for the day from the shades of lipstick that I choose. The makeup actually helps me to hide those little imperfections to at least look presentable. Everybody's beauty in their own skin. Like, you don't have to look lighter to look prettier. You don't have to have blue yeah. eyes to look prettier. No, I don't think looks matter. In a way, yes. I mean, you don't want to look sloppy. As a rebel. <laughs> Ways, I guess, in the way I dress, in the way I like to speak to people, the language I use, or just things which I know project the way I am is the way I express myself. The perception of beauty has definitely changed. The way people perceive beauty these days has definitely changed from, from 10 years ago. Yeah. Nowadays, people are trying to put more of a plastic sort of look on themselves. Everyone's trying to be someone else. Beauty standards right now these days are changing completely. So nowadays, someone might, what, what I think is beautiful, you might not think. You need to start carrying more stories and make it more personal. And maybe that story will, you know, switch a light in one woman's mind and um, it can, you know, spread across. We tend to associate beauty with females. I think it can expand to the other gender as well, but it's about what we're talking about that will make that difference. Beauty is for everyone. 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 For everyone. Yeah. <laughs>